So after leaving Dahab, I got the opportunity to go to one of the best places in the world to windsurf, Bonaire, where I would continue my Shaka journey. One of the struggles I had in Bonaire was the lighter winds. It made me realize how a lot of the progress I'd made in Dahab was due to the stronger wind and how important technique is with the Shaka. I also realized that using steep bits of chop makes it much easier to get into the air and I actually landed a few of what I would call shove it 360s where it's not really a proper Shaka but you complete a 360. I was really pushing for a proper Shaka but I didn't quite get it before leaving Bonaire but what an awesome place to winter. So I was back to the UK for the end of summer and beginning of autumn but to be honest as much as I wanted to land my first Shaka it wasn't happening. As the end of the year was approaching I headed to Brazil another world class canvas for freestyle windsurfing. One of my favourite spots was the lagoon because of the strong winds combined with perfect little Shaka ramps. I was now starting to really improve my technique and above everything else just felt like I was more committed to the move which resulted in some decent bloaty shove -its. After pushing hard, I managed to scrape together a few shove it 360s like I mentioned before, but I still couldn't get a real shaka. I was at the point now where I was getting good height, but not the best rotation, often landing on my back. Two things that really helped me solve this, one was looking as far as I could into the rotation, and the other was getting my weight further forward. And once I did this, well, I actually landed one. <laughs> 